Hello friends, welcome to Daring Marana YouTube channel. Today we will be discussing about fire on exhaust gas economizer, their causes, actions and what are the indications. Okay, exhaust gas economizer fire. A flame appears at economizer coil during running of main engine and exhaust gas burner, exhaust gas boiler is put into service with circulation of water is called economizer fire. Where there are various reasons for economizer fire are okay. A flame appear at economizer coil due to running of main engine and exhaust gas boiler is put into service with circulation of water is called economizer fire. Means a flame will appear at the economizer coil during running of main engine and exhaust gas boiler is put in service with circulation of water is called economizer fire. The economizer fire are reasons are due to suit deposits of an economizer coil, due to suit deposit on economizer coil, suit deposit are high by using high carbon content fuel. Due to suit deposit on economizer coil, the suit deposit will be high when using high carbon content fuel. At manuring time, incomplete combustion may occur. At manuring time, incomplete combustion may occur. At that time, at that time, fuel gas velocity is low. Fuel gas velocity is low. Thus, unburned fuel can adhering on economizer coil. Thus, unburned fuel can adhering on economizer coil. At manuring time, incomplete combustion combustion may occur at that time fuel gas velocity is low and thus unburned fuel can adhering on economizer coil air carry through exhaust gas due to excess supply or scavenger air carry through exhaust gas due to excess supply of scavenger flame is produced when air and fuel are proportionally mixed in sufficient heating temperature flame is produced when air and fuel are proportionally mixed in sufficient heating temperature okay we can say at manure time incomplete combustion combustion may occur and at that time fuel gas velocity will be low thus unburned fuel can adhere on economizer coil it can stick on ad economizer coil this may lead to fire is economizer fire or air carry through exhaust gas due to excess supply of scavenger due to excess supply of scavenger air may carry through exhaust gas then flame is produced when air and fuel are proportionally mixed with sufficient heating temperature maybe chance of flame is produced when air fuel and are proportionally with sufficient heating temperature okay here may be due to flame is produced when air fuel are proportionally with in sufficient heating temperature then what are the indications means overheating and peeling of paints at economizer body there will be overheating and peeling of paints at economizer body spark emit from the funnel we can see from spark from the funnel then sudden increase in uptake gas temperature there will be uptake gas temperature sudden increase will be there flame visible in smoke indicator smoke indicator there will be flame alarm come flame visible in the smoke indicator okay indication of economizer are economizer fire are overheating and peeling of painted economizer body spark emit from the funnel sudden increase in uptake gas temperature flame visible in the smoke indicator so what are the actions in we need to take in case of economizer fire are we need to inform bridge and chief engineer start standby auxiliary engine and prepare for engine slaughter we have to inform the bridge and chief engineer we have to start standby generator and prepare for engine slowdown. Slow down main engine and stop the engine if possible. If it is possible, we have to we need to slow down the engine. If possible, we have to stop the engine. Then we have to cover the turbocharger. We have to cover the turbocharger. Suit blow to be carried out to blow out suit. We have to do suit blow to carry to carry out to blow out suit. Always keep an eye on temperature. We have to keep we have to look at the temperature and all whether it is constantly varying. And never suit blow while economizer on fire and temperature above 600 degrees Celsius. We have to ensure that never do suit blow while the economizer is on fire and temperature is above uh, 600 degrees Celsius. It can cause hydrogen fire and meltdown of coal sets. So if you done, so we have to be very careful because never do suit blow while economizer on fire, uh, fire and temperature above 600 degrees Celsius. If you don't suit blow, it may it may lead to hydrogen fire and meltdown of the coal stacks. Even the metal will get burnt. So continue running circulating pump and keep a Okay. After this, continue running circulating pump and keep an eye on pump pressure. We have to we have to run the circulating pump and we have to keep an eye on the pump pressure, whether it's bearing or not, whether it's made in constant. If firefighting equipment is fitted on economizer, it should be fitted on put on operation and spray water on external casing of uptake to cool the affected area. We have to spray water on the external casing of the uptake to cool the affected area. Few times starting and stopping of main engine also help to blow out collected suited uptake. We have to few times starting and stopping of main engine help us to blow out collected suit at the uptake okay continuous running of circuiting pump should be maintained we have to keep on keep an eye on the pump pressure if firefighting equipment it is fitted on economizer it should be put in operation spray water on external casing of uptake to cool the affected area few times starting and stopping of main engine also have to blow out collector suit and uh, at uptake then these are all the things we need to do and after fire is out after the economizer exhaust gas bo boiler exhaust gas fire has been uh, fire is totally burned out 
then what is we need to do is after cooling down to ambient temperature open economizer cover after it is cooling down to ambient temperature we have we can open the economizer cover clean the inside parts of the we need to clean the inside part of the economizer check the tubes for any damage if any we need to repair it after finishing the after uh, of the fire is out we have to cool down to ambient temperature then open the economizer cover we have to clean the inner part of economizer check the tube for any leakage or damage if any if anything is there we need to repair it when suit fire happens we will inform bridge that's the right but first we will slow down the engine then the steam is allowed to dump to reduce the temperature of economizer the steam is allowed to dump to reduce the temperature of economizer suit blow is carried out to blow of suit we have to know the suit blow is carried out to blow of suit so we but we have to keep an eye on uptake temperature we have to keep an eye on uptake temperature suit blow should be stopped if temperature is above 600 degrees we have to ensure that suit blow should be stopped because it, otherwise it will lead to hydrogen fire if suit blow fire stop then engine rpm can be increased slowly but if not better to, to stop the engine okay if suit fire fire stop then engine rpm can be increased slowly but not if not better if it, it, it is better to stop the engine if possible just in this speed fire fighting equipment is provided should be used and outer surface should be we need to do boundary cooling and after fire stops let the economizer cool down and then opened up for inspection this is what we need to do when suit fire happen we need to inform bridge and chief engineer but when we need to slow down the engine speed then steam is allowed to dump to reduce the temperature of economizer suit blow is to carried out to blow out suit and we have to keep an eye on the uptake temperature suit blow should be stopped if temperature is above 600 degrees Celsius otherwise it leads to hydrogen fire if the suit blow suit fire stops then engine rpm can be increased slowly but if not better stop the engine then firefighting equipment is provided should be used an outer surface should be probably should be boundary cooled after fire stops let the economizer cool down and then open up for inspection and all if not any, if any fault we need to do proper repair and all thank you